Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. First of all, thank you for being here and supporting my channel. If you're new here, please subscribe to my channel and turn on the bell so you get notified whenever I post a new video. Okay, on today's video, I'm going to do a five year wear and tear on my Louis Vuitton Turin in PM size. So this is it. I did an unboxing for this bag around July 2016. I will insert um, the link here. So if you want to see me unbox this five years ago, you can. Okay, so five years, this is how my Turin looks like. Okay, the body, the shape it still holds um, nicely. Maybe I overstuff something here and yep, that's how it looks like the fascetta is still nice and this is the base the bottom i don't see any um any worn any wear and tear in here there is nothing it's still like very nice and i like the fascetta is like just nicely patina still light not very honey patina but it's just light patina after five years i think it's still good oh i have one um watermark if you can see over here there uh, over here but I think that's the only spot there that I can find at the moment let me find more the tap still nice and straight and I've seen a lot of people um, tap has curled up I think uh, that's because the way you keep it in the dust bag you have to be really careful you have to make sure that this goes straight instead of curling up so that's what I, I did, that's what I do. Make sure it is straight so that it will not curl up. Let's see the inside. Okay, the zipper is still nice. Um, and there is no tarnish, nothing with the zipper. Zipper still look nice. No, um, what do you call that, oxidation or something? No black spot in my hardware too maybe just a little bit in the inside just one spot but oh, you can't really see it you can't really see it anyway and the inside still just like new i don't wear this on daily basis so i i don't really wear this bag often maybe if, several times but not like this is not my everyday bag so um the tap looks like this i don't wear this in everyday basis and like this is the strap the strap still look nice too there i don't see any marks whatsoever here and the the back also still very nice and smooth still feels buttery and i don't have any marks at all and the hardware still very very shiny i don't see any black mark no oxidation everywhere so overall this is still in a very very good condition Okay, I think um, I really like um, the way the Turin PM holding up. Like I know it's a bit stuffy because I put some, uh, some like a back pillow inside. Maybe I stuff too much, but it looks, it looks heavier in this side than this one. But it looks okay. Still looks okay. Let me show you. Okay, this. Is the Turin PM 
still holding up very nicely even though I've had this for five years so again the only sign of wear that I see is this in here just one drop here one drop and that's it the rest um, I know this is not as light as it came before oh wait 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 I saw one more here there is one more spot over here there as you can see there is like a watermark but this is not very clear I mean if you see it like this it's like there's nothing not very visible okay so do you have a Turin PM how is your Turin PM holding up um, overall I'm very happy with mine all the stitching still intact I have no problem whatsoever so I'm very pleased with this I know that um, this one has the thicker canvas as you can see it's very stiff see compared to the canvas oh let me show you the, the canvas that I just bought um, this is my new graceful PM the one that just came from the store and I can feel the difference in canvas uh, with this one see the difference I can certainly feel different like if I see it with my eyes I can see um, different in color is that make sense this is like more of a um, brown greenish tone and this is more of a brown brown tone okay thank you so much guys for watching if you have any suggestion if you have any comment or you ask um, have any question please um, write down in the comment below I would love to hear from you thank you so much guys for watching bye